Greetings and salutations. This is Imperator Vespasian and his trusty sidekick. Hello. That's a very nice happy hello. Yeah. Um, we're bringing you another unboxing video. Um, it's not really an unboxing. It's it because there's no box to unbox. It's really more of a showcase, isn't it? Yeah. Um, you, I, if you're doing Space Wolves or indeed um, any other chapter that's got these these sort of packs in. Um, you can get these packs to upgrade your figures, and yeah. if, you, if you don't know that, then then you've learned something. And if you do, <laughs> then feel free to skip, or, or just listen to I name drivel. Um, so if you get something like this, which is normal Space Marines, yeah, um, that are doing something cool, and you want to make them into uh, Vilka Fenrika, or or Flesh Terrors, or Blood Angels, or Templars, or any of, the others, any of them really. <laughs> you can buy one of these quick packs. Uh, yeah. The packs cost about, I think about eight pound. I think they are, yeah, then. Um, so given that they're only bits, it's, it is quite expensive if you're adding, if you're making a large army, yeah. you're going to be spending eight pound and eight pound and eight pound and eight pound per unit. Yeah. But you can get uh, ten figures out of this one. This, this will do a full ten months. Worth. Yeah. So you're not going to have that many Space Marines, I no. suppose. So. No, exactly. So this is the Vilka Fenrika. Yep. Um, who are absolutely awesome. Um, we've got um, pauldrons for the um, Marines to have on their shoulders. What's that there? That's a cloak. Oh. Um, you get the normal Space Marine. I haven't got one unpacked, so sorry. No, that was quite cool. You get a, a normal Space Marine body. Yeah. And oh, I get you. So it's like yes, that yeah. So that's the back. You put you've got the front already in your box, so you yeah. put the front on, and then you put the jetpack on the back, and you've got yourself a wolf lord. Yeah, there, a wolf commander, which is actually really really cool. Yeah, yeah it is. It yeah. You. Um, you've also got the wolf's head helmet yeah. there, which is which is brilliant. Yeah, that wolf's head. Um, you've also got a another head which is very useful if you happen to have a uh, land raider um, that you want to command a fire in yeah. and um, you want to give him a wolf's head. That's just that could be useful for something like that. If if you had if you, are, I, I if you had a land raider that, yeah. that you wanted to give give a yeah. wolf's head tuck. If it, you it's, to if, yeah. if, it, but it, it obviously yeah. most yeah. people probably wouldn't, yeah. but if you did have one <laughs> Then it would be useful to have those spare bits. You could also give him, say, armor with um, the wolf's head on. Yeah, that's um, right. You know, yeah. a pauldron with wolf's. You know, just if, if you wanted. If to. you want, to, if, if you, you happen to, to have a land raider, yeah. that you, that you were doing that. Yeah. With. yeah. <laughs> just, just, just out there in case yeah. anyone's interested in exactly. the idea. Yeah. 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 yeah, 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 it's fine. Does that mean you're interested in that sort? You want um, to I've already you're done not it. Having... Oh, just... right. I see. <laughs> I haven't painted it yet. But... Um, yeah, so uh, you also get the Frost Axe. Yep. Uh, Space Wolves really like the Frost Axe. I've noticed that. An axe has a smile. Other weapons like chainsaws and stuff, they don't have a smile, no. but an axe has a smile. It does, doesn't yes. it? Because it's like... Yes, it's a smiling axe as it yeah. hacks it's into your things armor. And yeah. In a happy way. Yeah, <laughs> in a very, very, very happy, cheerful <laughs> way. That's, that's sort of it. Um, so yeah, you, you also get the chainsaw, which is yeah. an all-round chainsaw as opposed to the one-sided chainsaw, uh, because it's a blade, it's a double-sided blade. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Um, one side is for um, cutting at the enemy's armor, and the other side is for slicing at the enemy. Oh, okay. Um, because the blades are pulling backwards for yeah. slicing, oh, therefore okay. you will yeah, slice, slice straight through. Yeah. And if you want to cut, you flip the blade flip over. It. And because the blades are going the opposite way, it will cut through the arm. Yeah, yeah. that's clever. Yeah, yeah, that works. Yeah, yeah um, see how that works. Uh, which book is that? Is that um, the one where the attack horse's flagship was? It the one with the. Uh, I'm not sure. Kills the... I'm not sure because you've told me so many of them all. I know you. you can... <laughs> It, it might be, I don't know. Either one of them, anyway. We know well, it's not Vengeful Spirit because they're not in. Oh, okay. No, I don't no. Know. <laughs> um, but anyway, that's all explained. Yeah. Um, and of course, we don't actually use chainsaws today in modern warfare mm. because our armies aren't really up to date. Uh, we, 
I don't understand why we don't use chainsaws in standard combat. Because seriously, who would go to war with your army if your they army was equipped with chainsaws? No, yeah, yeah. no, they wouldn't. You could put ch a mini chainsaw on the end of your rifle. Yeah. Uh, and get rid it's of those. Probably due to expense. Yeah, but well, you can get rid of those silly rifles we use that fire little bullets. We yeah. could have a big bulky gun that fires sort of bolts with with rockets on yeah. the back. You call it a bolter. Yeah. You could do that. Yeah. That would be awesome. And and um, um, also land raiders. Well, why do we use tanks? They're rubbish. Land raiders have additional side sponsors yeah. with additional firepower. Yeah. And we have this rubbishy tank with one gun on it. I mean, you could fit four. Uh, sorry, six heavy bolts. Sorry, um, heavy machine guns to, to the side this of the tank. This is what happens. Inside. You see. You see. Yeah. What well, our tanks today are rubbish. Yeah, they are. Just, just we're so backwards. Yeah. yeah. Rubbish. Yeah. Um, so anyway, this is the the box you can get to simply upgrade your troops. Yeah. And that is all it is. And somehow we've made this video last six minutes for some reason. It's because you're waffling. Yeah, I am. <laughs> Um, so I think that's about everything. I think so too, yeah. 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 I don't think there's anything else we could explain about it that you wouldn't already know. Yeah, well, they're just straightforward yeah. conversion kits. Bits and pieces. Yeah. So if you're thinking of converting uh, standard marines into these, um, these are actually to go with uh, uh, command squad. Um, yeah. Here, I'm going to convert this command squad into Space Wolves, which is completely out of focus. Yeah. No, no, it doesn't want to, it doesn't like, I'm going to convert this command squad I think it's got, it's got into on Space it. Wolves. Yeah, I think that'd be cool. Yeah, so that's the, that's the overall plan. Yeah. Yes. So that's it. That's it, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. This has been Imperator Vespasian and his trusty sidekick. It so it's goodbye from me. And goodbye from him. Goodbye. Bye.